Hello, everybody. My name is Jason, and welcome to the Game Warrior, where today we have just heard announced on April 2nd, 2024, that DC Heroes United, the sequel to Marvel United Multiverse, has been announced. Simon is doing it again. Here's my first question to you out there in the internet world. Are you ready for another Marvel United? Excuse me, a United. Are you ready? Since the first one has not been delivered. And I don't mean the first one. I mean the last one. Wow. Jason, let's get on the ball here as we do the news. If we do this, we will get a free gift. It is over on GameFound, as everyone should know by now that DC has made a deal with GameFound and all of their stuff will be there. So I made a comment, but let's skip ahead and look at the art. It is very similar. The game looks exactly the same. I am sure it is going to be 100% compatible with the Marvel version of the game. Here is a question for you out there in internet world. Does this game have design space for a full DC set of heroes? Do you remember years ago, what was it, 30 years ago when Magic the Gathering came out? No one knew that it had the design space to keep going this long. Well. After Marvel United, the first one came out, I didn't think it even had the design space for X-Men. When I saw that, I went, well, it did. And now it appears to have the design space for Multiverse. Is there enough meat on the bones with this game, my friends? Is there enough meat on the bones for another full campaign so that these characters feel like the characters we are familiar with and at the same time, that the mechanics are new and fresh and it expands. Does it have enough meat on the bones? All right, you can see that it looks exactly the same. You've got the Joker, obviously a bad guy. Batman, obviously a good guy. Wonder Woman, and the other one would be Superman that they are showcasing here. Now, here is the problem, my friend. Do you see the problem? The problem is right here. This is it. Unless you are a huge DC fan, this is it. You got Superman, you got Batman, you got Wonder Woman. Everything else, eh. Maybe Aquaman, eh. Eh. DC. Full disclosure here, I used to own a comic book store. I sold so many comics, it's not even crazy. And I was never a DC fan. Yes, sometimes I would read them. Sometimes I liked a Batman story. Sometimes the breaking of the bat by Bane was amazing. Sometimes when doomsday killed superman some great storylines here and there but overall i am a marvel fan so first question is jason gonna get this what do you think right now off the bat you know what my first answer is no right out of the gate i just come out and say no why it feels too early to me to me it feels too early i'm like oh no like i just i just ordered the last one, and I'm waiting for it to get here, and you're asking me for more money already. Already I feel tight. That's my, that's my reaction. I don't know what you're feeling. Tappa, tappa, tappa out there. Tell me what you're feeling. Are you excited? Do you remember when Cthulhu, Death May Die, Fear of the Unknown, seasons three and four, effectively, the second version of Cthulhu, Death May Die, came out? I kept hoping for it. I kept waiting for it. I kept asking for it, and then boom, it finally came. They took their time, and when it came, I was so excited. So, if you give me enough time, maybe I get excited about DC Heroes. I am not there yet. It has not baked enough. I am not ready for this. I don't want it. Same thing happened with DC Deceased. It's like, whoa, wasn't that a little quick? That's what I feel here. It doesn't feel right in a timing sense, in a beat-by-beat -beat story sense for me. Now, if you're a huge DC fan and you've been hating the Marvel stuff and waiting for this, then you are going, hallelujah, this was what I wanted. So which one are you? Or are you the person who just doesn't care about this game at all? And I have no idea why you're even listening, watching to this video. Yes, Z Garcia over the Dice Tower rated Marvel United as number one game. Tom Vassell, number 10, Mike Delisio, 17. And the people said 26. A lot of other people like it. I like it. I went... I went in deep on Marvel United. I went all in almost for X-Men, and I missed the first one, so now I've been catching up. Anyways, that's all there is to say. 
it's just Marvel United in a DC skin. What do you think? What are your thoughts? This has been Jason from the Game Warrior talking about DC Heroes United.